done. I need some hoops. <laughs> I need some hoops. All right, hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. We are basically jumping straight into it today because it's a heavy, heavy work day. Actually, yesterday, Sunday, was supposed to be my heavy work day. But, well, it started off good. I was working on stuff for clinic. Out of nowhere, I got this pounding headache. And I was like, maybe I'm staring at these screens too long, like phone, computer, TV. Let me go outside, get some fresh air. Sometimes you just gotta touch grass. I went outside, took a walk, and I did feel better. But a little while later, the headache came back. And then there was this spider. And listen, that spider was fighting for its life. And you know what? I respect it, but I finally got his ass and I was just like, you know what, this whole ordeal, headache, spider, I'm gonna just go to bed and we will wake up and try again tomorrow. So what we're gonna do today is run through my to-do list. Ooh, sorry for the camera reflection, but here's my to-do list. I actually already did my five minute journal and I worked out, y'all just gotta take my word for it. So I'm about to head to a study room so I can read for admin law and then after that I have errands I need to run. Also y'all, I broke my pinky nail. Well, I needed a fill anyways, but I gotta walk around like this until Thursday. Just tacky, but in case you see it when I'm typing. to discuss cause I think we need my fault and without any doubt though I'm a me I be a doubt though I look for fear the girl I look for fear the girl is out though I'm a mind that's you be dark oh. I put my life into my job and I know I'm in trouble she manipulate my love oh. mm, I know holy and I know that Uh, oh, this broken nail. It's Sherling. Very cute for fall. Anyway, I feel like I got a good amount done. I still have two cases to read for admin law, but I was just tired of reading for that class. It's so boring. So boring. Um, so I'll finish reading when I come back. I'm going to run my errands. I gotta get groceries. I feel like I'm always getting groceries in these videos. But I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's. Um, I have to get a car wash. And my car is white, so when it's dirty, it's like bad. But um, I also have an Aritzia return. So I got the Molina pants, like, two sizes too big i've actually had these for a year hopefully they let me exchange them because they still have the tags and these pants are so cute i can't believe i haven't worn them yet but they're too big way too big so i just want to exchange these these pants i just bought recently they're so oh the lighting sucks my bad but they're so cute they're these cargo kind of pants got these in a size small definitely needed a medium online those pants are back ordered until april 28th 2023 like you want me to wait until may they cute but they're not that air cute <laughs> i'm just hoping they have them in store but i'm about to leave y'all so uh, maybe i won't bring my camera yeah i might leave y'all here i'm sorry <laughs> I'm irritated. I'm so irritated <laughs> because somebody scratched up my back bumper, didn't leave a note. And a part of me was like, maybe this just happened at the car wash I went to. But I have a feeling it happened in the parking garage because the same thing happened one L year. Granted, the damage was worse last year. But and also, I'm like, am I the last good person left? Because listen, I too, I too have hit somebody's back bumper in a parking lot. This was like my second year of college. But guess what? Guess what I did? I left them a note, like. <laughs> also on the list of things that irritated me this week, I don't know if you guys remember when I got that chemical pill, I think like two vlogs ago. Yeah, it was too strong, way too strong. And you know, she apologized and she's so nice. I couldn't even be 
mad irritated yes but it left hyperpigmentation on my forehead mainly but it's okay it's okay <laughs> y'all i'm so done with today i'm so done why the f is there a bug in my fried <gasps> do y'all see that this is sick this is sick what is that another one? Oh my god i'm so oh my god this shit is sick like this is sick sickening let me take my trash out this is crazy this is crazy I've heard from this place before i probably ate a dead bug beef <laughs> no Monday, I was going to do my meal prep, but then I checked the clock. I'm like, oh, it's kind of getting a little late for that. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. I'm going to bed. <laughs> yeah, okay. I decided to start editing my video a little bit. <laughs> I realized at the beginning of this vlog, I said there was a spider. These are two separate two separate things, okay? Okay, one thing I do is keep my space very clean and organized. Them bugs was cooked into that damn rice, and you know they was. I just had to get that out. <laughs> All right, y'all, it's Thursday. I feel so bad because I really have not vlogged at all this week, but low key, the whole week just been out of whack. Like, one of my professors has COVID, so class has been on Zoom. Uh, for clinic, we had to go do class at our clinic office in Santa Ana instead of on campus. Like, it's just, <laughs> and honestly, I was just tired, y'all. It's that point in the semester, you know, where you're like, okay, we, we gotta wrap this up. But am I ready for finals? No. <laughs> anyway, I'm about to make breakfast really quickly and then head to class. Look, I just flip the switch. I don't know nobody else is doing this. Body start to drop, hey. Now they wanna know me since I hit the top, hey. This a rolling, not a stop. Why shit don't never stop? This the flow that got the block hot, shit got super hot. I could drop in and then drop my ass right back out. But from 12 to 1, I was helping Balsa with like um, our Spooky Grams fundraiser thing. So I didn't have time to eat. And then I have my next class at 1.30. So making a green smoothie really quickly. Honestly, I only hope and pray I get back in these housing units um, next school year. Because as you guys know, this spring I'll be in D.C. So I'm giving up my lease. But I'm so close to campus. It's crazy. I don't want to have to deal with parking, a parking pass, nothing of the sort when I'm so used to walking literally five minutes to campus in five minutes back. But anyway, I'm gonna make this and go to class. All right, you guys, I'm home. I'm so tired. So tired. Y'all, when I flex what what it's getting a little crazy <laughs> i had every intention of making today a super productive day i was gonna get good footage i was gonna go to a new coffee shop do my readings then let's, i ordered that chick-fil-a and everything went left i actually started this show on netflix First, from scratch. I thought that was gonna be a cute little love story. No, it got very sad, very fast. But I was watching that, I worked out and I got my nails done. Loki hate the color, but <laughs> anyway, point being, I did not get any footage today, y'all. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'll try to salvage what's left of this vlog tonight, but ooh. 
She might not get posted. I'm sorry. I'm finishing um, up getting ready for tonight's festivities. And then I'll be back to show y'all the finished look. I'm a clover from bringing on. Actually, I'm not a huge um, Halloween person. So I feel like my costumes are always simple but effective. Like last year, I was Janet Jackson in Poetic Justice. And you cannot tell me I didn't look like Janet. You couldn't tell me I was not Janet. I feel like this costume is similar, you know, simple, but it's still getting a job. But this is so cute. It's so cute. I need a picture. <laughs> and then I'm going to carry my white Telfar. And as I was getting ready, I was watching some of the online Makeup Academy videos. Huge shout out to them for sponsoring your girl. For those of you who might not be familiar, Online Makeup Academy is a online makeup academy. <laughs> but no, they get you together, especially if you want to be an actual makeup artist. But even if you don't and you're sort of just a makeup enthusiast, such as myself, they have hours upon hours upon hours worth of valuable content about makeup application on different skin tones, different skin types. They show you how to get a natural glam beat. Um, they go over hygiene protocols. And after completing the course, you do get a certificate. We let out for us. And it's funny because I actually learned how to do my own makeup from watching videos, like YouTube videos. Jackie Ina, back when she was Lil Pumpkin Pie 05, yeah, she taught me everything there was to know about base and foundation and applying eyeshadow. But I think the difference between watching a YouTube video and doing a course like this one is that one, you're taught by industry accredited makeup artists. And two, they give you one-on-one -on -one feedback. So it's sort of like a mentorship aspect. You can message them, they'll respond, answer whatever questions you have. And that's no shade to any of my YouTube makeup artists or Jackie Ina listening. I love her down. <laughs> but I'm just saying, I think that aspect is what's different from solely watching a YouTube video. But wait, because there's more. With Online Makeup Academy, you also get a pro discount with brands like Anastasia, NYX, Makeup Forever, and you also get lifetime access to the course. So you can always go back and revisit the videos if you need to. Actually, let me show you one of the ones I was watching. The videos I was watching is the red lip demo because if it's one thing I love, it's a red lip child. But it's crazy because you think it's so simple and then the video goes super in depth. Like, I do feel like I know a thing or two about makeup application, but I was watching this like, damn. <laughs> so you're still learning. So if you want to check out the Online Makeup Academy course or just click around on the website a little bit, it will be linked in the description box down below along with the coupon code that is also somewhere on the screen. But huge thank you to Online Makeup Academy for sponsoring today's video. And now we could go turn up. <laughs> Actually, I lied. One more thing. Guess who met a subscriber today? Not me, but my mom. Isn't that crazy? It was so funny to me. She was getting her eyebrows done at the place me, her, and my sister have gone to for like years. And she was recognized. So I just wanted to say, hey girl, if you happen to be watching this video, my mom said you were super nice and you're also a law student at Berkeley. But... <laughs> front to back it was bound to happen but I'm about to <laughs> I'm about to try to take some pictures it's like 1 15 I really need a picture y'all I need the picture so I'm gonna set up my tripod I've actually never done this before and I caught well I don't want to say caught like but I saw this girl taking her pictures there um, the other day I think she got embarrassed by my grabbing in the house talking to a camera this is a judgment-free zone but I'm gonna make the tea, 
take the picture. All right, we're just gonna try it. <laughs> this is so funny to me. I need to go to bed. To make some ginger tea. Also, taking some of these vitamin C drops. <laughs> Listen, I'm not playing any games. I'm not gonna hold you. My immune system is quite strong. Like, hold on. <laughs> I gotta knock on wood. But still. And I'm honestly debating if I want to make some of these waffle fries from Trader Joe's. I need to just go to bed. I need to just go to bed, but I kind of want the fries. And then I'm also finishing. The last episode I was watching, there's only 12 minutes left um, of this show from scratch that I was talking about earlier. But back to the fries. No, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not. All right, y'all. I'm <clears throat> I'm ending one vlog and starting another. I feel like this one was kind of okay. My voice. I feel like this vlog was kind of all over the place, so I'm sorry. But I hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.